Yeah, sometimes you can't tell when a nominee thinks on a particular issue, and other times you can. Here, the president himself has signaled he already knows her views on the Second Amendment going on. I mean, like, you started this in person here. Miller. Right, yeah. You're going to miss the shuttle, then? Wherever you get your podcast. So, you're going to miss the shuttle, then? Yep. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What is up guys? Welcome back to Heavy Duty Hustle. So today's the day you guys, we actually get to get on a truck and start hitting the roads. I didn't actually think I'd be happy about that, but shit, after being here for like a whole week, it's kind of like a breath of fresh air. So, you know, I said that shit three times, I couldn't get it. But yeah, we're getting everything together. We're packing up all our electronics, our luggage, and then we have snacks in that back corner over there. And then we need to, we just need to clean this place up. Like everything's all dirty. We have like things on the floor. So yeah, that's what kind of happens after a week. Um, I was gonna mention to you guys something funny that happened a couple days ago. All right guys, so the story goes that me and Noah got on the shuttle from the main terminal and we were on our way back to the hotel. But we were dropping off these two guys in the back row. They were going to the Waffle House. And so they were like, hey, can you drop us off at the Waffle House? Then so the shuttle driver pulled up to the Waffle House and we opened the door for them. They were getting out. And as they were getting out, the other guy that was in the back row was like, hey, someone forgot a mask here. And everyone that's been taking the shuttle this past week knows that that mask has been back there like all week long. And everyone's been sitting on it, like stepping on it, everything. And so it was just back there. And and he's like, well, let me see the mask. And then it was some old man. He was like, oh, shit. Well, that's not my mask, but you know what? I'll take it anyways. It looks like a good mask. And me and Noah look at each other like, oh, hell no. Nah. And so, yeah, we we're like, oh, damn, that's kind of, eh. But, um, yeah, me and Noah, as you guys can see, we're in the semi. We, um, we met our driver. We talked to him. Noah's just relaxing before he has to start driving. We got our first trip. Our first trip, he said we got to pick up in Alabama and then somewhere in Alabama, not too sure. It's going to be like an hour drive to get there. And then after that, we're going to go ahead and drive all the way down to Fort Worth, Texas and deliver there. So this whole week has been nothing but like having a lot of patience and I want to say relaxing, but shoot, I mean, I guess it has been relaxing because we, we've woken up pretty late these past few days and like went to bed super late. So, yeah, I know we're going to have to get into, like, the groove of a new sleeping schedule and stuff. But we'll see what happens, you know. Um, our trainer seems really cool. He's um, He's been with the company for a, lot, a long time. I think he said, like, 12 years or something like that. Maybe he said 18. I'm not too sure, to be honest. I'll get those facts checked. But I'm not going to miss the, the breakfast at all. I might miss the, the lunch and stuff and, you know... Comedy Central and being able to lay down for a good while going to Walmart and watching Noah Prowl for you know I do want to say that I'm glad that we started driving this Monday because there's people waiting and like they're telling them that their wait time is gonna be like Wednesday or Thursday and then another person told me that they were supposed to start on like Wednesday or Thursday this past week like before us but they were told that their truck needed maintenance like an oil change and a bunch of air leaks and stuff so um, yeah, they have to get that taken care of. So he was like, oh, I don't know when we're going to take off. So good thing, like, our truck, I mean, our truck seems good, you know. It's a 2020, I think. It has 213,271 miles. Um, it's a Kenworth. They told us we're going to be on a Freightliner, but you know what? I'll take the Kenworth shit. Are you excited, Noah? Yeah. You ready to stay up a whole 18 hours and drive? Nineteen. I know, I'm just messing with you. But, yeah, I mean, let's just get this done, let's get this going, let this month go by fast. I'm just looking forward to the big paychecks, that's it. I'm just here big, for the money. Yeah, big to us, because shoot, we're, we're used to like small checks, you know, like 300, 600 a week. So, I mean, while you're in training as a driver, you know. I mean, I'm not even used to getting checks every week. I'm used to bi-weekly. Oh, yeah, and that's true. So, like, bi-weekly, it's like, well, no, it would be getting, like, what, a $700 check, something like that? I would get $700 and over times 1000 So, um, yeah, so, I mean, big checks to us, so. But other than that, I'll leave you guys with that. I'll give you an update on how our first trip went, how we uh, thought it was going to go. 
If you guys are new, don't forget to subscribe. Leave some comments down below if you guys have any questions for us or if um, you guys are just, I don't know, curious about anything. And um, we'll answer them in a future video. Other than that, yeah, I'll update you guys in the next one. Peace.